Now, the Nigerian military says it will continue to provide physical and combat training to cadets of Nigerian Defense Academy, NDA, with all necessary basic military skills, character development and academics to enable them to fit into military career to surmount security challenges in the country. They gave the assurance at the Battle Inoculation Exercise Camp Highland 2023 for cadets of 70 Regular Corps Army and Air Force Regiment direct short service courses, 27 Army and 31 Air Force in Katia, Kaduna State. The 70th course cadets were engaged in citizens and leadership training in JAS, then proceeded to Katia for their final outdoor physical and armor combat handling military training. The special guest of honor, who was the commanding general officer 3 division of Nigerian Army, Major General Abdul Salam Abubakar, says the cadets are mentally and physical, physically ready for tax to surmount banditry, insurgency, and other challenges within and outside without fear. For you, the passing out cadets, this exercise has given you the experience of what may likely what will likely confront you in the battlefield. It has also given you a foretaste of what you will be going through as subalterns while occupying junior leadership positions in the various theaters of operations within and of course outside the country. Our nation is currently faced with numerous contemporary security challenges. The Nigerian Armed Forces, in collaboration with other sister agencies, has the constitutional mandate to combat these threats to national security. You, the personal cadets, must therefore fall in line with the leadership concept of the Chief of Defense Staff, which is to nurture a professional armed forces of Nigeria that is people-centric and capable of meeting its constitutional responsibilities in a joint and collaborative environment. The Director of Military Training says the cadets are fully equipped and ready to face numerous contemporary security challenges of the country, noting that mastering tactics, physical fitness and mental alertness will make them succeed. The battle inoculation and firepower demonstration is, signifies the victory as well as the total defeat of the Atarudu boys terrorists to signify the victory against the adversary which will lead to a victory march to the table hilltop by the cadets have so far shown high level of commitment, endurance and teamwork during the exercise. It is designed to test and confirm their leadership competence, endurance as well as their understanding of tactical maneuvers and overall military training. With the level of training and commitment attained by these cadets, I have no doubt that they will perform credibly well as junior leaders when deployed in the field. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.